Impaired glucose tolerance is a pre-diabetic state of hyperglycemia that is associated with insulin resistance and increased risk of cardiovascular pathology. IGT may precede type 2 diabetes mellitus by many years. IGT is also a risk factor for mortality. Criteria According to the criteria of the World Health Organization and the American Diabetes Association, impaired glucose tolerance is defined as, 2-hour glucose levels of 140 to 199 mg per dl on the 75G oral glucose tolerance test. A patient is said to be under the condition of IgT when he she is an intermediately raised glucose level after 2 hours, but less than the level that would qualify for type 2 diabetes mellitus. The fasting glucose may be either normal or mildly elevated. From 10 to 15 percent of adults in the United States have impaired glucose tolerance or impaired fasting glucose. Treatment The risk of progression to diabetes and development of cardiovascular disease is greater than for impaired fasting glucose. Although some drugs can delay the onset of diabetes, lifestyle modifications play a greater role in the prevention of diabetes. Patients identified as having an IGT should exercise regularly, lose 5 to 7 percent of body weight, and limit intake of sugar and highly processed carbohydrates. See also, glucose tolerance test, impaired fasting glucose. References. Further reading, Melanie J. Davis, I. Peter Gray. Impaired glucose tolerance. British Medical Journal 312. 264 Euro 265 DOI 10.1136/BMJ 312.7026.264 PMC 2,349,870 PMID 8,611,769 Editorial Review Nathan DM Davidson Manitoba DeFronzo RA Heiner, R. J. Henry, R. R. Prattley, R. Zinman, B. American Diabetes, Association. Impaired Fasting Glucose and Impaired Glucose Tolerance, Implications for Care. Diabetes Care 30, 753 Euro 9 DOI, 10.2337 DC07-9920. PMID 17,327,355